Are these Wednesdays reels driving you crazy? Especially if you're on TikTok, you can't say no to it. And you must be curious about what Netflix's show Wednesday is about, but not quite sure if it's worth watching or not. Then let us break it to you as it's packed with some interesting behind the scenes facts. These are definitely gonna make you watch Wednesday from today. What's more, these facts become even more exciting and juicy if you've already watched the movie. Because finding out something unknown about the movie or your favorite actor's interests thrills us even more. Trust me, today's video is gonna blow your mind, so keep watching till the end. Fascinating Mysterious Hand Wednesday is leaving everyone startled by its outstanding characters doing the best they can do. Their unbeatable performance is proof of why it hit the ground running. One of the most famous things about Wednesday revolving around social media nowadays is that mysterious hand. If you thought it was nothing more than a CG character, you're wrong. It's amazing how they chose to be extraordinary over ease. Well, perfection comes with hard work, so here we've got another live character, Victor Dorambantu, behind that hand. Despite having the whole body or even a single dialogue, he communicated a lot. Of course, it requires a professional magician background, which Dorambantu is an expert in. Besides being a magician, he's a creature performer too. But was it enough to give life to a hand? No, as it's the result of teamwork, which includes the great director Tim Burton too. His direction has led that hand without voice and body to an emotional creature. Besides this, computer technology gave it a fine touch to keep it smoother. Still, hats off to the consistency of Dora Bantu by the way he managed to give those meaningful shots. If you think having just a hand in a movie is not a big deal, then let us uncover the truth. The expert illusionist Dora Bantu had to sit under tables or many other things for hours to give the best shot. This is hard enough for anyone to do, but Dora Bantu made it possible with his proficiency. Then comes the importance of the hand. Did it even deserve that kind of hard work? Indeed, yes, because this is the only thing Wednesday seems attached to. Wednesday is a kind of reserved one. However, when it comes to that hand thing's injury, she looks sad for the first time. What's going on between Wednesdays? If you're a fan of Wednesday season one, you can't say that you are not a fan of Christina Ricci. Christina Ricci started working as a child actor and made her name with the release of this masterpiece Wednesday in the 90s. She got the lead role as Wednesday Adams and made every scene special with her unmatched performance. Now, fans were worried if she'll get the lead role in season two or if the new one would be able to ace the role like her. All of a sudden, here we have Jenna Ortega as Wednesday and Christina as Miss Thornhill. After watching this year's Wednesday series, it turns out that Jenna has lived up to Wednesday's fans' expectations. According to the director, it seems like Jenna was the only one who could handle the role with such perfection. Even her personal features became a part of her role. After all that, do you think Jenna needed Christina's advice and guidelines for her role? Comment below and let us know. Although both of them worked on the same role, in a recent interview, Jenna reveals that she never talked about the role to Christina. They didn't even use the word Wednesday in front of each other. Is that for good? If yes, then how? It's because both of them are too sensible for this. First of all, Jenna thinks everyone has different skills and art with which no one else can interfere. So she thinks Christina never spoke about it because she didn't want to show that she was the one who did it right. Likewise, Jenna didn't want to intrude on something done 30 years ago. Furthermore, as we're having things like superpowers, which were absent in the previous series, this demands a newer version of Wednesday's character and they don't need to be the same. Number three, the love triangle. Did you like the love triangle in a show like Wednesday? And if you didn't, why is that so? On one side, where everyone is going crazy about the series and making amusing edits to it, the other side comes with disagreements on adding the love triangle. She is strong, strictly stuck to her goals and hard to distract. Then how come her personality got muddled in a love triangle? So who we have here in the triangle is Wednesday, Xavier, and Tyler. One is an artist and the other is a barista. Tim must be kidding, right? Now we'll have to see such a powerful girl who's had a lot to do and fight for confused in boys. This is unacceptable for a dark character like her. The time has passed and it's the 21st century. It shouldn't be compulsory for girls to go through complex romantic relationships to complete their stories. For Wednesday, love should have been the last thing on her mind. Still, if your opinion is that love completes a story or drama, are you sure it would be a love triangle? Even if you're a romantic genre fan, a love triangle is too old and odd to add to the show. Okay, we must say that the way Wednesday started having feelings for her peers is worthwhile and pleasing. Though, it's not about the boys, but Enid. She's the only one who seems her true and justifiable peer caring about Wednesday's safety. 
More importantly, of course, viewers can have biased opinions, but what about Jenna Ortega? Even she herself was against the love triangle as she thinks it doesn't suit her personality and the Adams family. Impressive lessons Jenna learned other than lines. Giving the show such a natural feel is not as easy as you think. It demands reliability and consistency. Choosing something difficult over what you can have without any effort certainly gives exceptional results. Watching it if you felt like it was actually going on in reality reveals the artist's professional attitude. Similarly, you must have thought how come Jenna played cello so smoothly, right? She must be faking it. Hold on, let us surprise you with the amazing fact that she started learning cello two months before the shooting. Now she knows how to play it, yet she couldn't excel like an experienced player. That's why her performance was dubbed for perfection. But she loved the experience and called it a delightful activity. Clearly, there was much more for Wednesday other than just a cello playing. For instance, fencing, archery, and learning other languages. It really needs a person who's passionate about this character. So here, Tim was absolutely correct in calling Jenna the only best option for Wednesday. Following this, Jenna's perfection in all the extracurricular activities shows her dedication to the character. She performed everything like she is more like Wednesday than Jenna. Another important thing that you may have missed is her static body with no blinking at all. When Tim realized that Ortega hardly blinks and looks through her eyebrows, it was creepy enough to be added to Wednesday's character. Even so, no blinking at all is another thing, especially in a place like Romania. The cold winds of Romania couldn't stop her from giving her best. She skillfully took control of this with her tricks and intelligence by blinking when the focus shifted to other characters. And this is how Jenna's personal mannerisms helped her a lot. What's the reality behind Wednesday's iconic viral dance? The reasons why we listed this point as number one are numerous. Being a TikTok user, you may have already been obsessed with these unusual dance moves. As soon as the series came, her dance spread like a fire. What's so special about this dance? Well, almost everything. First, she did something beyond fans' expectations. In keeping with her cold personality, we could never imagine her grooving on the floor. We all thought she would simply stand still as she always does and won't participate in anything. What she did was the opposite and still keeping up her stone face was adorable. Secondly, let us shock you a bit more with the fact that the choreographer of this unique dance is none other than Jenna Ortega. This is crazy how someone can be so talented and skillful. She searched her dance moves and instilled them with goth culture. Additionally, she got some moves from Susie Sue and others from the Adams Family 1996. Now it's just her and the goo goo muck sound on the floor. When it comes to Wednesday, who cares about others? So she literally danced like no one was watching. What's more fascinating is her dance becoming a trend and challenge on TikTok. Right now, we can imagine how far it can go as we don't have any excuses why it shouldn't. These gripping behind the scene facts mentioned above are the valid reasons why you must watch Wednesday. In fact, its fans must be feeling amazed to find out such facts. So, do you know any other unknown facts about Wednesday that we missed? Please voice your thoughts in the comments section below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.